So Luke, you've joined us permanently. You must be delighted to be back at Bristol. Yeah, definitely. It's uh, it's been a, a long time since I first came to the club back in two thousand and six, but um, it's not. It's nice to be back. It's a place that's quite close to my heart, and to be back here pushing for for the Premiership, uh, where where the club deserves to be as well. So great to be part of that. Have you sensed a significant change from ten years ago to now? Yeah, well, times times just changed uh, in general, don't they? It's uh, a lot, a lot, a lot's changed. Obviously, in ten years, obviously personnel and everything like that. But the drive and determination is the is is the main difference. I think everyone here is um, pushing for that professionalism, um, those those standards that are driven throughout the club, and everyone's just driving for driving for success this year. You played a key part in the 2010 playoff push, which unfortunately ended in defeat against Exeter. This time around, what's different? I don't, obviously, I've been away for quite a long time now, but um, I'm not. I don't think the belief was really there back then. Um, whereas this year, throughout the club, from the support staff to the players to the coaches to the fans, I think you can really feel the the atmosphere and the buzz about the place, and everyone believes that. That this is Bristol's time. Was it an easy decision to to make that loan move permanent? Uh, yeah, definitely. So it's, it's a place that um, I love personally and my family love, um, and it's a great place to play rugby. It's a, it's the club that gave me the chance to to first play Premiership rugby, and I I wouldn't have done a, a lot of what I've done in the game without without Bristol's influence. When you play at Ashton Gate, I mean, it just shows you the potential that this club has. Yeah, it's a phenomenal stadium. Um, obviously, it's going to be even better um, when that when the new stand's finished, uh, and hopefully, when that when that is finished, we can pack it out and uh, get all the supports down from for Bristol in the Premiership. First and foremost, a big couple of months coming up now for the boys. Yeah, everyone talks about the Premiership, but we're not looking at ahead in the next game. Um, we know they've got we've got. A f- Few difficult games coming up, um, even before we get to the to the playoffs. So we just take them. I know it's a massive cliche, but take one game at a time, um, and just keep building and building towards the ultimate goal.